Hello, it's Vanessa McLean of It's In Your Story. This week I had a fantastic time with a group of young people who are living their passion, doing what they feel and they know is their calling. Let's get the picture as well, but I know you've got... Where's your foot? Well, do you know what, yeah? Real. Big up to Jamal Woon on a great performance at the end. And yeah, man, just thanks everyone for coming out, man. I feel that it went well and um, it was amazing. So, yeah, man, um, big up yourself. Gotcha, captured you. We're rolling, mate. What's going on, guys? Uh, Mr. Hector here. I'm with uh, my auntie Vanessa. Um, I just want to thank everyone for coming out to the Wednesdays with Jaden show. Um, it was amazing. Thanks, thanks to Jaden for having me. Um, we got Jamal Woon on the performance as well, and it was amazing. Um, it went really well, man. I thought that I got to be myself and, and I gave the people a bit more of me, so yeah, we got. Nathan, when people come to see you, what is it that you really want them to take away with them? That anything's possible if you just put your mind to it and it doesn't matter where you come from or what you've been through. If you have a passion or, or you have a dream, just work at it and just don't give up, yeah. One of the big questions that a lot of people always ask me, and I'm going to ask you, what is it that gives you the drive to get up every day and do what you do? Just the thought of failing, I guess. Yeah, just the thought of failing and, and just being just another guy. Like, I always said to myself when I, when I started this with Ant, like my, my, my best friend, I just said, look, we can't be just those other guys. We just have to stand out and do what we do best and just try and, and, and work hard and, and be determined. So I just think it's that thing of not falling off, as people would say, and, and, and just just keeping the momentum up and, and just keeping the people ready just for more work, you know? I think that's what kind of drives me. And I, like, I, I, like we also said to ourselves that we, we can't just be those other guys and be statistics, you know what I'm saying? Because there's so many people that want to do it, but that don't want to, that don't want to work hard and put in the groundwork and then complain that they're not getting anywhere. So for me, that, I think that's what it is, yeah. It was wonderful seeing you this afternoon, being interviewed by Jaden and seeing the young people in the room totally inspired by your ambition, by your tenacity to, to put everything into what you're doing. And really, Nathan, I think you are a true inspiration. Tell us about some of the films that you've been signed up to do recently. Um, I've just finished a short film called Love on the Line that should be coming out uh, this month. Uh, last year I've done a film called The Intent that will be coming out this year at some point or maybe next year. I've also done an anti-bullying campaign short film called Will You quiet. Kill Me Now yeah. um, trailer for that's out now that should be out um, this year or maybe next year and it should possibly be getting turned into a feature film next year which I'm really excited about um, I've just been cast as Terence in an online web based drama series called Brothers and Suits that's a legal drama series um, that'll be getting filmed in August, September and October and the pilot should be with you guys by December slash January next year. Um, I've just been confirmed for another feature film, which is next year as well. I can't really say too much. Um, I've just finished the comedy spoof at the YouTube studios as well. And just a couple of other bits and bobs, man. I'm just keeping active and just making sure that I create work that people can take something away from. So, yeah. We love what you're doing, keep doing what you're doing. What I really love about what you, you, how you represent yourself as a really grounded young man and you know success is really coming your way, but keep grounded as you are and bless us with your talents. We need more young people just like you. Thank you very much, thank you. Appreciate it. Thanks. Don't let anything stop you. What inspired me most about these young people was that they had such drive. They were driven. So maybe that's the word for you today. Find the drive, find first gear, second gear, third gear, rev it right up to fifth gear because you've got it in you. Don't let anything stop you from reaching the destination. And here's the other thing, when you get to the destination, you'll find that really wasn't the final destination. There's somewhere else that you need to go. Be like the young people I've been around this week. They've inspired me to put my foot down, forget about automatic, but to find even sixth or maybe a seventh gear. I am Vanessa McLean and it's in your story.